All that's left is two tasks. The first task is getting to the orb um, of Zot and picking it up. The second task is taking the orb all the way out to the dungeon. Hopefully it won't be too hard. There's that orb guardian. Now are you, um, you're exist extremely resistant, so I don't think I can hit you with agony. Let's just see. Um, convulsive and agony. So you can't be agonied, the, the orb guardian. Which hurts me quite a bit. Let's heal up uh, another one there. Agony, agony. One's not good enough, I guess. Taking a beating from those orb guardians. So let's heal up a little bit. There's the orb of fire from before. Uh, let's do this. Let's actually put on swiftness and haste and just move away. Ah, oh. well, there he is. Let's go up. This is actually a perfect time to use this, this. I'll use repel missiles, and I'll use space shift. I'll charge up my mana. And we'll go down. And it'll say, hi, what's up? Time to die. Let's see if these ar arrows of frost will do anything to him. If he's just resisting him, then I guess they're no good. But I heard that they're okay for... It's okay to use frost arrows on these things. Doesn't seem to be the case though, does it? I'm pumping them full of stuff that's not really doing much. Let's just use regular arrows. Yeah, regular arrows to do more. Read this book. There's this junction in there. So, this build disables the space and the sphere around you for a while, causing anyone nearby to randomly blink. The chance of blinking depends on the distance from you uh, being nearly certain when directly adjacent. Cyrus, like, you know, a get off me type spell. Pretty much it's just dispersal again, but whatever. Um, I actually want to go out to the dungeon one more time to sort of get rid of these uh, crappy frost arrows if it's not helping. If stuff isn't helping, I don't want to keep it, basically. I want to win this game, right? So. Drop off. This arrow, this arrow. I'll drop this first two. I'll just pick up only regular arrows. And we'll drop off some of the arrows just so I can lumber around at least. Well, I ain't gonna bring around 300, which should be more than sufficient to um, probably pelt everything in the orb chamber. Alright, so let's see here. Um, let's get down to... I feel a bit more experienced for some reason. But whatever. Let's go down to uh, Zop 5 again. Hit you with a couple of agony blasts. A couple more colors. And they both uh, called stuff, I think. One of them's dead. They're confused now. Alright, let's see here. I want to pelt you. Uh, you can help fire with smiting, I think, which is kind of annoying. Okay, are these, all these guys summoned? Let's try mass abjuration. Send a bunch of them away. Do that again. Yeah. Don't like these uh, guys, Sally. Go this way. I want to kill everything that's possibly going to be in the way, but safely. Here. Agony, agony. Do that. Agony, agony. Do that. Agony, agony. Do 
Do that. Let's see if I can get rid of that with a uh, mass adder. It is a summon guy, right? Yeah, it's summon. So Do this, and they're both gone. Agony, agony. Heal up. And we're done. Next level. Get some corpses from here. A bunch of these guys are having draining weapons, apparently. Luckily, I don't care about draining weapons anymore, so it's fine. Get these. There's an orb garden, so agony, agony, agony. Why am I burdened? Because I got too many arrows, apparently. Alright, let's see here. Um, I was thinking about using this digging wand to sort of making it easier to get out. So let's just think about that for now and save my time. Um, all the up staircases are all the way up there. I basically want to let's go here and we'll evoke digging in this way and we'll do it here it's just one over here that's a quick way over here but let's just go quickly here I'm going to do digging actually this is Wipe out the entire wall right there. And way out down here. Again, let's just wipe out the wall. That's good enough. Okay, is there anything closer perhaps? Let's see where this goes. Yep, that's definitely closer, so won't worry about that. down here and let's just do one quick dig right here and drop the wand so there we go there's a little you know um, change is done there's a dragon to kill that hurt a little bit so we'll heal up And we're in the orb chamber. Let's see where the Zot traps might be. Orb guardian there. No, why'd you see me? Okay, get over here and apparently destroyed my guy right off the bat. Haste myself. Let's do agony, agony. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, let's put in swiftness and I'm gonna run away. Run away. Agony, agony. Agony, agony. That's not gonna work, so let's pulse him with arrows. Heal up. Bone dragon. Very easy fodder. A few blasts to kill him, though. Okay. All that's out of the okay. way. Let's see what's on the other side, just to serve. Ooh. Do this. I miscast haste. Spitness. Agony. Agony it again. I actually want to make sure I use up these arrows of flame if possible. Agony. Agony again. And he's dead. Um, bolt of draining is down to 2%. I actually want to test it, but for now, turn this off. We'll just start turning bows up because bows is what we're using right now to kill stuff.
Another one. Looks like there's a spear trap and a net trap there, but nothing else of uh, value. Oh, there's an overfire. Wait for this calm tam to go away. Okay, that guy definitely saw me, so I just want to back off. And you're just approaching, 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 so you must be dealt with. So must you. You're still in the way, so. Oh, not a good place to be hit. Um, let's do this. Put on repel missiles. Agony again. This is where having a bolt to drain or something like that would be nice. Do swiftness. Well, this guy's blocking, I guess, sort of, so we'll, we'll keep that for now. We'll do shell creatures. And again, he'll give us night first, I guess. Oh, I've got sticky flames on me. Do this. It's agony, that didn't work, so fire this. Agony again. Looking bolst. Oh, that's mine. Let's back up. One more, apparently. Mana, agony. Wish they stopped coming. Yeah, I saw that one coming. You're out of the way. Let's get a little mana back. And let's just move our way back to the staircase out here. There is an ancient lich. Let's put this on. Do this. And he's got summons. But I can deal with those. Yeah, speed yourself up. Do this. And I just want to get close to him, or he's already close to me, so it's the spell undead. Oh, spell undead. The spell undead. Mass abjure. And get back our man a little bit. There's the orb of fire. It came out to play. Um, I'm already set up to fight it, so let's just get to it then. Fire, 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 fire. I decompose for a moment. Go this way. And it's finally on top of me. Let's do... Oh, nice. I got a nice swarm. Gonna hurry everyone around me. But there we go. It's finally going after my shadow creatures. And it's gone. So an orb of fire has been dealt with. There's an orb guardian. Agony you a little bit. You're out of the way. And draconian. A agony, agony. Uh, cursed toe, why not? Well, I'll fit closer. Get a little mana first. We gone. Decomposing a little bit, that's fine. Or Guardian. Boom. Boom. Dealt with. Let's see what this cloak is all about. And it's a cloak of magic resistance. Very nice, actually. Uh, I won't use it, though, because preservation is better, but... Let 
Another cloak. Cloak of Darkness. Very interesting. Don't need that at all, but, you know, good to find out. Put on Preservation. Next to clear out a little bit. of these starter enemies. Oh, there's a guy up there. Go away. Okay, here's why I'm just gonna beef up myself with haste. I'm gonna put on that, this. Um, I don't really need mana for killing an or orb of fire, luckily, so start pelting him. I'll back up a little bit. And try summoning stuff around me a little bit. There we go. Tentacle Monstrosity will be useful. Damn. Now I'm a bit concerned. Um, it would be nice if these guys distracted it for a moment, but they're not. Luckily, I'm faster than the Orb of Guardian, so... Let's get away a little bit. I don't think it'll fire through the Orb of Guardian, but the Orb Guardian itself is pretty... Um, sufficient to hurt me. Oh, I'm no longer hasted. Put on haste. Taking too much time on a retreat. Oh. Another one. Let's get our mana back up at least. Um, agony, agony, agony. You're a black one, apparently. Do this. Luckily, he's using fireballs and not hellfire. But he could use hellfire. Get your back up again. Okay, let's deal with the Scorcher before he causes more problems. There he is. Zap, 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 zap. Done. Yeah, let's go deal with the Orb of Fire that's now down here. I'm being vicious. Where is it? Uh, I can't leave it over the fire there, but let's just see where his tentacle monstrosity is first. There. Oops. Blink. Done. And they just keep respawning and respawning is what they're doing, Sally. Okay, I'm gonna put on haste. I'm gonna put on face shift. And this, and we're just gonna dig toward this guy. Oh, he's not there. And it's fire, 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 fire. Hmm. I guess I don't have or anything. If you, uh, are lucky. And another one. Let's 
slowly make my way through here. What well, it's all about, just slowly going forward. Do this quickly. Okay, there it is. Fire, fire, fire. Oh, don't like that. Yeah, he saw me. Just gonna keep out of range that killer clown in case. Alright, it's dead. So, do view. Back up, back up, back up. Here's good. Shadow creature, that's not good. Shadow creature, that's really good. Boom, boom. In a sense, Shadow creature just feels way too strong. Yeah, that's something easy to kill. Oh, took three shots. Almost dead. You are dead. Now I gotta deal with that guy. Injure you a little bit. Why am I not picking up that arrow trap on the, the trap? Is a trap. Zap, zap. Or if anything new is spawning. Zap, 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 zap. Oh. Back up, back up. That's good enough. Agony him again if possible. Ow, that hurt. Get my man a little bit. Heal up if possible. What's really nice about the orb chamber is that it's hard for stuff to escape the orb chamber, but you know, you just have to deal with it when it does. If it teleports basically, that's when it, it'll teleport on you. Make sure I have the appropriate stuff. Pick this up. Um, the Orb of Fire. How am I going to deal with you? I'm going to do Swiftness right now. I'm going to make sure I have Evasion on. And we're just going to lure you away. Because I don't, I don't like being right next to the bottom lung like this. It's a little too close. I'll start firing here in the main entrance area. I'm assuming that there's a teleport trap somewhere in the vicinity of the orb chamber because you don't usually see orb grunts stepping outside and they are doing this a little bit too much. Enough. Enough. Just back off, I guess. Did they get stuck or something? They do sometimes get stuck, the NPCs, you know. They'll go over here instead of going down there. Do this. Do this. Do this. Hit you. Hit you. There's our friend the Annihilator. He's going to get closer, so I better. Yeah, he's got. He's came out in front of those other guys. Agony. That's good enough. Just help them now. I bet the other guys get stuck, but whatever. 
the main threat was the annihilator and he's dead. How to do the Orpus out without healing? This is how, basically. Agony a little bit. Probably throw a net on me, apparently. Agony. I can do uh, my um, new spell. Bolt the draining now. Zap. Zap. So there's where I can use bolt the draining to get through. Could you get out of your net? Go here. Uh, I'm down over 10 hit, hit points. I think this is actually a good time to think about possibly using self restoration. How this spell works is a new one, I guess, for the new version. Uh, Permanent loss to one magic point, restore your strength, exert your intelligence, and heal at large point for right hit points. So, I suppose if I lose any more hit points, I might do that or. Whatnot. Drone Dragon. Ooh, I hit a teleport trap. Let's see if I can move away from that. Good, I got away from the Orb, the orb Guardian. Let's move away from this guy for now. Get out of the way. So there's the teleport trap that's been sending these guys spiraling into the main dungeon. Uh, I don't want to take two of these guys at once. Break your back. Recall. Perfect time for a recall. Agony, 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 agony. Wow, I feel so many agonies. I'm just one stupid guy. Move away. There we go, I agonied him for once. Okay, he's dead. Get back my man a little bit. There's one more arm grind that came over here, but where he stepped in that trap or not is another thing. Or there, that trap dead too. That could be another one that could send him away. Uh, back up. Luckily, I got away from one of them. Agony, agony, agony. Too many unreliable agony on these guys, so maybe I'll stop doing it. This. But let's see here. Agony once. And it does take out half your health. Let's see what Bolt of Draining will do on him. Zap. That kills him instantly. I should just use Bolt of Draining. How much damage do I do with Bolt of Training? Almost full, so I guess there's really no reason not to use Bolt of Training if it's applicable. So, get closer. Zap. Of course, it misses him. But, it seems more reliable on killing him. Do that once, and then we'll do Bolt of Training after. There goes Contamination. There's the orb chamber. Last, you know, inner orb chamber. You're dead. I'm gonna go over this way now to see if there's anything I can clear the other way. Ow. Ow. Stop hitting me. You're dead. Do a thing kept bolted to spell me or something. Okay, we got nothing top. top. Looks like I cleared out everything at the bottom. Oh boy, there's electric golem right there. Um, back up. If possible, I want to avoid him. Keep him asleep. There's a Zot trap. Oh, something else got sliced. No. 
Oh, yeah, why not? Okay. Zap him once and again. And let's do bolt draining, bolt draining. Bolt draining is definitely more effective. And here's the thing. I can't apport the orb. I could try, but it'll wake up that electric golem and be much easier just to serve. Step forward. Pick it up. And that actually woke up the um, guy. And I'm actually carrying way too many arrows at Earth stuff, apparently. So, all right. First things first, let's evoke teleport so I can get out of here. And I'm going to activate, or I'm actually wear this. I'm going to drop uh, this. I don't need to have this anymore. Um, don't need stasis. Don't really need the teleportation ring. Don't need this. And let's drop 100 arrows, or all my arrows apparently. There. All right, let's get out to the main dungeon. And Hellhounds. All right. Disintegrate this. Let's go up to this one now. He's on top of me, but whatever. Just quick swiftness. What was my plan here for getting out? Just go up to that one right so that's easy enough to get to Ryan Devil fast let's go up this way go to the main dungeon Hell Sentinel go this way Why are you uh, keeping up with me, you stupid thing? Haste again. Uh, go another way. Okay, keep going this way. Okay, we're out. Okay, I'm picking up anything on my way out. Um... I don't need any of this stuff, but silence could be useful if, you know, there's something to spell cast and I don't want to spell cast on me, I guess. Or, no, it's not really. Nothing here is really useful. I suppose I could take the, dig uh, the digging wands if I need them, but, um, yeah, I'll take the digging wands. Those are useful. Red double pops out, but whatever. And let's just get out of here. D1. Finish this uh, game and be done with it, basically. Solier. I have no idea where I'm walking to. So I wasn't going up this top staircase. Uh, Demon trying it guy. Cell Sentinel. Do, 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 do. Tormentor. I just realized it, but I'm burdened. I'm carrying too much, so drop 100 regular arrows. Do that, get myself up a little bit faster. I'm a little bit contaminated, but that's to be expected because I keep casting haste. D1. Shadow Imp, don't care. Abomination, don't care. Iron Imp, don't care. Watch a Pan Lord pop out, then I'll care. There we go, our Pan Lord. Don't know why he does, but um, we're going to do Swiftness, and he got Executioner backing up. And it's going to try and outrun him to right here, apparently. You're not a summon, are you? Nope, you're real. Real, real action executioner. Uh, I could let him hit me all the way up, but a better idea would just be to kill him, so. Do this. And you are out of the way. Now. 
Kill the Kazit. Abomination, don't care. Keep going. Of course, you're faster than me. Go win. Here we are. And I am out. I've escaped. Hey, look, you no longer get the do you want to win um, message anymore. You just escape. So there we are. Um, I escaped with the orb with my mummy necromancer. Uh, I suppose I could have uh, tried to do you know more more or runes, but the thing is I really hated this run, um, you know just because of the slow leveling of the mummy. I bit, I did have her demonstrate a little bit about uh, what the um, what the mummy has to go through and what the new version 12 is like. So there you have the new version. I'll try and do another run with um, a couple more characters. I'm going to try and do a slug elf priest next uh, because slug elves and priests are getting removed in the next version. So. Maybe try and see if I can do a run with that. I'll also try and get some conjuration spells shown off and do that as well. Uh, I guess for now, since we're done this, I'm going to go open up, I believe it's my computer, and we'll go local disk, documents and settings. Uh, I think it's this, in application data, crawl, morgue. And here we are. Um, if I open up this one right here, 512, I think it's today. Is it today? No, this one's today. So, escape with the orb. There's the full file for the orb um, run and all that. I'll select all, copy that. We'll go to um, Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. Main form. I shall do it from here since I know you guys are going to see it. So that's like my main game. For it. I'll make a note there that I've won and all that. You can go to. This Fred here. Yet another victory post. M U N E. YouTube version. First YouTube video. YouTube run. Version 012. Full run. And you can just look at the code and all that. Or you look inside the code for this basically. That's where it's going to be. I did hate this run. I also hate this because, uh, well, let's just put it this way archery. Archery's not my thing. And like you know, that's just basically what this you know this guy used to fight um, when he couldn't use the criminals to get by. And of course, lackluster items sort of hamper me as well. So, okay, there you go. Quick message. And apparently I, I see it. I'm not going to take out a couple things in here. We're going to take out something you don't really need, by the way. If uh, you're posting more files, just take out the monster kills. You don't have to show off what everything you kill. So just get rid of all this stuff. And shouldn't be too much left. So there's another full list. This takes up most of the morgue file. 
Hey, I killed my own ghost. I remember that. Actually, I don't. I had a ghost. So, Banker's Creatures, blah, blah, blah. Get real serious. There's a preview of it. So there's the more file you can look at. You can see all the inventory I use and all that other stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed the run. I will try and get, um, uh, you know, faster videos next time. Like, I just didn't enjoy the Mummy Necromancer. And I actually probably won't enjoy this like Elf Priest now that I think about it, but I'll do it anyways. Just to try and get it out of the way. So you can look at this on the forums. I'll just do a quick look link here. That's pretty much true. I'm never gonna use a mummy again. You the Fred here. Sure. And I'll take you straight to the Fred in the Yarnar yeah, Victory Post. Blah blah. And that's just basically it. We basically completed the new run, and I'll be it. Hope you enjoyed. Oh, there's the run before this.